Good morning to all my fairy followers. This is April's March haul from Dollar Tree. As you can see, I've been busy. I wanted to put a little magic in my fairy garden, so I got some beautiful butterflies for it. Got a pair of these. This one was so pretty by itself, I ended up getting one. Another pair. And I also got some that are on sticks, um, on picks, where I can um, stick them in the garden. I found these cute little fairy lights. Um, thought they were so cute. They'd be great for my fairy garden. Put a little bit of color in it. These are little daisies. Little fireflies. Love them. And of course, the magic, the butterflies. They have 10 little tiny lights. I'm going to be doing a big area in my shade garden, so I bought some um, shade area uh, flowers. Hopefully they're gonna work, I don't know, we'll see. I saw that and I thought it was cute, so I bought that. And I also stocked up on little pots. I have two of these, so there's four all together. And there's three of these here in the middle. And I only show one here, but I bought five of them because they're pretty good size. So that was my haul for this month of April. Hope you enjoyed it. Please tell all your friends. And sometime in April, I will try to use some or all of these items so you can see them in the fairy garden. Uh, the lights I might run over three months uh, use one each month and that way I'll have three post lights in the garden post but anyway I'm always happy when I find things that are cute don't forget to share this post with all your friends and family don't forget uh, we have a, a contest running through April to the middle of May that's the 15th of May April to 15th anybody that you um, Get to sign up under your name to follow my uh, YouTube channel. This is just for the YouTube, you guys. Um, you, uh, if you get 10, you get a gift. If you get 25, you get a second gift. If you get 50, you get a third gift. And this means everybody can win if they go out and do the work. So, but that's only for the YouTube. I got a wonderful buy at Lowe's. As you can see here, I have two flasks of six packs. I had each one of these, there is um, 10 six packs in each one, so that is 20. Each one of those, of course, has six flasks, that's why they call them six packs. Got each one for a dollar. So for $20, I got over 100 plants. Now, none of these plants are going to be very tall. They're all low growing. I'm going to put most of them in the background or edging around my food garden or in to add a little color to my fairy gardens. But still, that's a lot of plants and a lot of fairy gardens. I still am going to have to buy uh, at least one or two big ones for each container to have some height. But that's still fine. The most important thing, I don't have to spend a lot of money for all of them. So that's under 20 cents a plant. That's I think that's 15 or 16 cents a plant. And I have over 100. So you're going to see so much color this year in this garden. Um, I'm also going to be moving uh, all of these containers this week. And moving them into their new home. And I will show you a picture of that too. It's going to be such an exciting month. I have so many things to plant and move. And let's see how it turns out. And I can't wait to share it with you all. I went to the 99 cent store to get some more bulbs for my bulb fairy gardens that I'm doing right now. And I wanted to get a little more metal sculpture as you can see. I really got a good selection and it really wasn't very much money. 
with everything I had here. Got here was a dollar. Got five of those. Four gladiolus. And five of those. They look pretty. The peacock orchids. And then of course, you know, I love the Dutch iris since I have quite a few in the backyard. And then here is a beautiful metal sculpture, believe it or not, a dollar. Here's one with a bumblebee, another dollar. And here one with a dragonfly for a dollar. And I just love the ladybug too, it's so pretty. And then this one, it's one of those really tall ones. And it has a beautiful hummingbird on it. Now they had some more of these things over at the 99 cent store I could have bought, but you know, grandma's always on a fixed income and she ran out of money. So this is all I got this week from the 99 cent store. This is probably all I'm getting for the month. Because I think I've, I've spent all the money I can spend for a month now. So we'll have to wait for May for another haul from the 99 cent store. Since I went to Dollar Tree this month, I went to Home Depot this month, I went to uh, Costco this month, and I have spent a ton of money. So I am done spending money. So that's it for this month. Let's see how many things I can get built and done with what I purchased. Oh, I forgot to mention the cost of all of this was eight dollars, but that was because it all came from the 99, I mean, yeah, 99 cent store. Eight dollar haul. Can't beat that.